Hey guys, One Piece Nation here today to bring you a quick One Piece discussion video on will there be pairings in One Piece? Now, I know what you're probably thinking. Oda said, of course there won't be pairings in One Piece. But you need to think about it. After this special, well, I, I, I'm starting to doubt that. Because this special, uh, One Piece, Adventure Neverlandia, implied Laura Lor F. Robin and Luffy F. Nami tremendously. So, I'm just going to talk about why I think they could, the pairing could possibly happen after the events of this special. Now, I just want to say that Nami was all over Luffy in this special. Literally, all over him. Like, there was body contact so many times. Half of the time, it seemed like Nami was doing it intentionally. And... You could just tell that Nami, like, the way she was acting around Luffy was, like, very much more concerned about him than she normally would be about anybody else in the crew. Now, this has always been that way. Nami has always been easy, become a very easily worried about anybody, but this was more than she would have been about anybody else. In fact, if Laura got shot with a bullet, I really think Nami would just be like, Jackass, get up. Knowing he was fine, but this is different. But this is like, Nami was like really freaking out a lot of times in this special, and she seemed so concerned about Luffy. And it, there were so many implications in this special, like, you really need to see it to understand it, like the tone. But if the tone of the special makes you think, like, is Toei trying to imply Nami has some kind of feeling for Luffy? Luffy didn't really return any of it. Luffy was literally his normal... Luffy was just his normal idiot self in this special. He really was. But you could just... Is it trying to imply Nami has feelings for Luffy? There is a one thing with Robin and Zoro. Where uh, somebody called Zoro uh, Robin a lady. And Zoro's like... Automatically all of his attention is on the guy. And he actually kind of glares at him. I'm like... Is Laura fucking jealous or something? I don't really know. Is Laura not like Robin being referred to like that? I don't know. But the main ones are Luffy X Nami, and they're there. Like, to understand why I'm talking about you to watch the special, but a great instance is when Lou Nami tried to convince Luffy not to go after the crew. Now, this I automatically know is kind of weird, because Nami is pretty much telling Luffy in this thing his safety is more important than theirs to her. And it's never been directly stated, but it is kind of implied that the crew does care more about Luffy than they do about themselves. But that's only themselves. It's never been, there's never been a situation where they tried to stop Luffy from saving their own crewmate. Nami right here is telling Luffy no. She's trying to stop him from going after the rest of her friend. Because she doesn't want him to get hurt. With that alone, considering how your strong the straw hat bond is, said something... The fact that Nami would rather Luffy not go after their friend until they have a plan. Wait and let their friend possibly and just let run the risk of then going to impel down. Just so he just to make sure he doesn't get hurt is saying something. But there's also a couple of other things like when Luffy gets shot with that bullet and he's trying to well after Luffy is spitting out the water, Nami's holding his hand the entire time with, you know, that alone was just the way... Normally I wouldn't make a big deal, but the way she was doing it was like very protectively. It was very odd. And then there was also the thing. When Luffy got shot with that bullet, we saw Nami madder than we had ever seen her in the theory. Like, we seen Nami pissed. But the look in Nami's eyes was one of like utter rage. Like she... Like you could tell she was... Like, she wasn't willing, she wasn't looking to hurt that vice admiral. She was looking to kill that guy. Like, she was so angry over Luffy getting shot with that bullet. I mean, to the point where it can't just be, like, a, like your friend getting shot. No, she was steaming with anger. But, um, the Bethel heavily implied it, I mean, and I had... What I was going to say, I wouldn't mind it, because honestly, I feel like there's a lot of comedic potential for Luffy being in some kind of relationship with a woman. There are so many things Luffy would probably just do. Like, the thing, like, I, would, I would, like, love it, like, you know, somebody would, like, you know, like, the woman would probably, like, not could have, like, a loose, like, set or something, like, what's that? You know what I mean? Like, there are, there are, like Luffy's an idiot, so there's, like, 
Luffy isn't like other anime characters. The best example is Goku. Luffy not like Naruto where he's an idiot, but he's still a dude. No, Luffy's an overall idiot. Like he doesn't know anything about sex. He's not. He he doesn't he doesn't like really have any show too much interest in women because he doesn't care. He's too oblivious to even think about it. Well, I do. I I'm positive he likes women. I'm sorry. I I'm, I'm positive he swings that direction. I'm sure about that. But the point I'm making is that he. Just, Never, you know, need to be smart enough to figure out why. But I mean, this special is, is so forced, like the Luffy, like the Nami, like having feelings for Luffy thing. I'm like, Magaka can change her mind, and I'm starting to wonder has Oda changed his mind? Like, are they going to do some pairing in this? Are they? I mean, is Oda going to bring pairing into one piece, especially in the manga lately? Like, a couple of chapters ago, Nami ran to Luffy's arm, sobbing. Like, it star I'm starting to think Oda may be, may be planning on implementing some romance. But if, you, if you're looking at the past couple of, like, recently, there was that thing when, you know, Nami ran and Luffy, and hugged Luffy, like, sobbing when she had to tell him what happened, whatever happened to Sanji. We still don't fucking know what happened to Sanji, by the way. But... There was that, and then there was all that other thing, when, uh, and you also, uh, Oda also had drops hint. Like, he had small things, like, in Punk Hazard, she was, she, she was feeding Luffy. There's, like, small things throughout the series that Nami had done in, and in cover pages. You notice, Nami is always in color pages. In cover page, he's normally sitting near Luffy and doing something very playful with him. There's just that one cover page pre time where he puts the, uh, like, glass stick with a mustache on his face. You know, there's, there's a lot of things that, there's a lot, there's, I think there's another one where she's, uh, there's another one where I'm pretty sure, yeah, she's, like, hugging Luffy while he screams at a zombie while he's eating a piece of meat. He's normally oblivious to it all, but... Is definitely there. And if I were to give my opinion, I will say I do like the idea of Luffy as Nami being a pairing. Yeah, I do think it would work really well. But the way I see that kind of pairing working is I don't see it changing really anything. I feel like it'd be the kind of pairing that would just be like you would have these really funny ass moments where Nami like tried to do something with Luffy and he had done something retarded. Every blue, every like arc, there'll be that one moment where Luffy and they try to do something just alone, and Luffy fucked everything up by like starting a battle or pissing somebody off or something. And just, it, it honestly, it wouldn't change relationship very much. Like, that's what I've always said. When, when you have two people that are this close, like this good of friends, and you, and they start a relationship, there's a very good chance the only differences are going to be things like they do things you would do when you're in a relationship, like make out, have sex, you know what I mean? Honestly, I just don't see why Oda doesn't do it. I mean, I see why, I mean, I think his quote was, this is a boy manga, if you want romance, go read a girl manga. But I, I, know, I don't know how long ago he said that. I think he may have said that a long time. He may not have realized how, like, you know, I guess, how many, I guess how many people actually care about pairings, like, if you look at it, look at Naruto, uh, most of the Naruto fan base gets a shit about no pairing, and Naruto has more male fans than female fans, and has a very large female fan base, but the male fandom is still bigger. Maybe he realized that, and he was like, oh, I guess guys don't mind having romance in the series. Well, I can make this work if they want it, I can give it to them. Maybe that's what his thought process is. I don't know. Maybe, maybe he's just pulling a Toriyama and just wants to give Luffy a fucking kid. For all we know, maybe he just wants Luffy to have a kid, and he just doesn't want it to be some random ass woman that we don't know, and to be out of fucking nowhere. So he's starting to build a relationship through Luffy. I don't know. I'm going to say, honestly, I do prefer Nami as a character over Hancock. I actually hate Hancock. And I'm going to make a video on why I hate Hancock eventually. But yeah, so did you guys think, like, this movie is hinting at there being pairings in One Piece? And how do you feel about, like, Zoro as Robin and Luffy as Nami? And how do you feel about there being pairings in One Piece? Like, would it bother you? Like, did you want it? And 
even if you don't want it, would it ruin the theory for you? For me, it wouldn't, as long as it was handled correctly. And I and I and and after this special, I think it definitely can be. If Toei can make it, can make non, can make non look like she has feeling for Luffy and make it look this natural, then Oda can do it too. Because Oda's a much better writer than any of anything, any of the shit writers that Toei have. But uh, the point is that just tell me your thoughts in the comment section down below. Please like, comment, and subscribe for more videos. It's a One Piece Nation signing out. Have a great day, guys.